But Miss Shirley, I've got basketball practice. Yeah, Miss Shirley, I've got dance practice. Yeah, Miss Shirley, I've got training practice. Ah, oh, this bitch! Okay, I've got rehearsal, practice, training. Drills. What's another word for practice? Class, you heard Miss Ragnar herself. Those who fail this exam may be expelled from the academy. And this time, I really can't help you. Miss Shirley, I'm sure you just tell that to everyone to scare us, right? Whether it's true or not, you still have to do your best. This is your last chance. Anyway, I'll still be here if you guys need me, okay? She thinks I'm gonna spend my weekend in school studying? Ah, I don't think so. I'm out of here. Hey, you wanna sleep and revise together? Yes, totally. We should take this time to revise our topics, especially all these squiggly lines over here. This, this is English, right? <laughs> I'm just kidding, it's science. <laughs> Miss Shirley, I still have a lot of questions about the exam I want to ask you. Debbie, do you think this is the right place to be asking questions? Um, is this the right place to be asking you questions? It's too late now. Should I just cheat? No, cheating should never be the option. Then how am I going to possibly cram all of this information in one night? Don't worry, based on my calculations of past year exam papers, these are the questions that are repeated every single year. So long as we memorize the questions and the steps needed to get to the answers, we're going to do just fine. Okay, so based on my calculations for my previous exams, I failed all but two. So based on the odds and how much I've studied so far, I have 0.5% chance of me passing. And there's also basketball practice later. So there's another minus 0.2% chance of me passing. Bro, you okay? I don't think so, Ben. I don't think so. Jasmine, I've studied all night. I think I'm ready. Come on, test me. See if I know the answers. Alright, Julian. What's the longest side of a right angle triangle called? That's easy. It's the high... high... Hypopotamus? It's called the hypotenuse. Hypotenuse? Why do they make the words sound so similar? Are they trying to trick us all? I thought I studied enough, but I guess I didn't. What is wrong with me? Why can't I remember anything? What's wrong with my brain? Badgeline! Badgeline! Um, can I have my ruler back, please? Thank you. Thanks for stopping me, Debbie. I could have really hurt myself. Um, maybe you could use this? so hard on yourself. Just treat it like any other exam. I'm sure you'll be fine. You're right. I need to calm down. Okay. But then they said that if you fail, you'll get expelled. Huh? But they were only saying that to scare us, right? Yeah, they're probably just trying to scare us. I thought so. But then they did expel the kid from N41. But, I mean, what's the worst that can happen? If you get expelled, you don't get to see your friends, your favourite teachers. Oh, and aren't you close to Sherilyn? Good luck with that. Long distance never works out. <laughs> oh, was it something I said? Okay, can anyone tell me what is Newton's third law? What goes up must come down. How is that even possible? Very sound. Why do you always have to argue with me? I just don't agree. Why can't it be what goes down must come up? Or, or, what goes left can go right. That makes more sense. Wait, is that the Newton's law about an apple? Apple law? A uh, doctor day keeps the apple away? Newton's law implies that for every action, there is an equal opposite reaction. By pushing someone away from you, you push yourself away from them. Okay, I think it's time for a break.
How are you guys doing with exam revision? <laughs> As more if I kill me, amor. Sorry, Vincent. What? <laughs> so you in bed, you? Ay, caramba. I think he said he's a toilet. Is anyone going to tell him that we don't take Spanish? Others, how am I supposed to memorize all these things? I wasn't even alive during this time period. Like, like who made the light bulb? That's easy, Debbie. It's Elon Musk. Elon Musk? Are you sure? He isn't even from that time period. That's where you're wrong, Debbie. He also invented the electric shaver. Oh, I didn't know that. Thanks, Terry. Terry, what are you doing? That's not even the right topic. Yeah, but I'm just taking on a competition. Think about it. If more people fail, they'll be more lenient in marking our papers. They can't possibly fail us all, right? Or we could all just pass, right? Right? <laughs> you're funny, Julie. Really funny. The equation has, we'll use what is called the discriminant. Hey, is that class rush? 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 Good day for Chris. Hey, can I borrow your notes? Notes? These notes? These notes that I spent day and night working on, listening and writing everything down in class? It's not my fault that you didn't listen the whole year and you want my notes right now before the exam? Yeah, so can I borrow your notes? These notes? These notes that I spent day and night working on... Okay, 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 okay. I'll just find someone else. So... Can I borrow your notes? This note? Hey Denise, can I borrow some notes? Kevin, I think we should all make our own notes. Besides, I'll need mine to study. Huh, <laughs> you don't want to share with me your notes because you're afraid that I'll get a higher score than you. It's okay, I get it. It's cool, it's cool, it's cool. You guys got any notes? I was actually about to ask you that, Kevin. How about you, Ben? Do you have any notes? I have an excuse note. Would that help? What can I rely on anyone these days? I am so sorry about that. Can I still hang out with you guys after school? Please. Hey Kevin, you can have my note. <gasps> really? Yeah, it's a birthday note. My mom left it on the fridge this morning. You can have it. It's not even my birthday. <sighs> yes, there's only one option. Drop out? Not that one. Give up? Uh, not that one too. Okay, I guess there's only Three options. Alright guys, you've all been gathered here because each and every one of you has a very special skill set in which we're yet to find out because this is kind of a last minute thing but here's what we're going to do. We are all going to practice texting without looking at our phones so that during the exam, we can all text each other the answers and pass with flying colours. You know they confiscate our phones before the exams, right? They've been doing it like every year. <sighs> she does have a point. Okay, well, scratch that. Let's go with plan B. We are going to learn Morse code. So during the exam, when I say... That means B. So when you say... That means B, right? <sighs> that means F, Ben. Have you been listening? What about... <gasps> Kevin, that is very inappropriate. You kiss your mother with that mouth? Wouldn't it be too suspicious if we are making so much noise? Forget it then. How about this? I will call my butler, Walleter, to hide outside the classroom and he will be whispering answers to us through the headphones that we will all be wearing during the exams and we will pass with flying colors. Are you sure he's down for that? Yeah, are you sure he's cool with it? Oh, come on. Walleter does everything we ask him to do. No? No? You guys doubt me? Huh, okay. I'll show you. Walter, You want to help us cheat in the next exam? You're with my mom. Ah, she heard everything. Ah, of course, loudspeaker. Yeah, I'm on the way. So, uh, I gotta go, guys. What are you kids doing here?
Mr. Dan, what are you doing playing with the lights? The electricity bill is already expensive as it is. Would there be a need for me to cut your pay? But, but, no buts. But I don't even get paid! Let me sleep in the storeroom. I don't even get lights after 7 p.m. Oh man. Ah. Oh man. Would you like me to remind you how much you scored for your exams last year? I expect nothing less than perfect from you this year. If not, I will have no choice but to send you to boarding school. You understand? <laughs> <laughs>